In the news, weakness in our protective atmosphere. Way up high, an unseen layer of ozone gas protects us from the sun's burning rays. But that protection has a weak spot. We'll be back with ozone in the news. And now, ozone in the news. The atmosphere around Earth includes a high layer of ozone gas. The ozone absorbs many of the sun's ultraviolet rays, the rays that cause sunburn. In this way, the ozone protects us from the worst effects of these burning rays. Recently, scientists discovered a weak spot in the ozone layer over Antarctica, the icy continent at the South Pole. Satellite photos show that a hole opens for a few months during Antarctica's springtime. Scientists aren't sure what causes this weakness, and they're worried that it might happen over a populated area. They say increased ultraviolet radiation through a hole in the ozone could raise temperatures, damage farm crops, and cause a lot more sunburn. Experts wonder if increased burning rays may have already damaged the food chain of Antarctic animals. Some scientists think the ozone layer is weakened by chemicals called chlorofluorocarbons, known more simply as CFCs. CFCs are used in automobile air conditioners, home insulation, and in plastic cups. Eight years ago, because they were believed to be damaging the ozone layer, CFCs were banned from aerosol cans in the United States. Now, with an eye on what's happening over Antarctica, some scientists want a worldwide ban on all uses of CFCs. I'm Christopher Glenn with Earth's Ozone Layer, in the news. Thank you.